Several weeks ago, I got the awesome opportunity to take part in the WWE 2K19 press event with 2K, where they revealed this year's cover star, the WWE 2K19 release date, and a pretty damn awesome challenge for the WWE games community. I'm the revolution, and by now I'm sure you're all aware that this year's cover star is none other than SmackDown's very own phenomenal AJ Styles. Styles joins a whole host of WWE legends including The Rock, Brock Lesnar, CM Punk, Seth Rollins, Stone Cold and many many more to be featured on the cover of a WWE video game. For the last few weeks now many fans speculated that it would be AJ Styles on the cover of this year's game if not a female superstar making it the first on the back of the recent publicity around the women's evolution. While I personally would have loved to see a female superstar like Charlotte Flair on the cover, you can't argue that AJ Styles isn't a phenomenal choice and you have to admit, he's had an amazing career, not just in WWE. His whole career is basically a highlight reel of great wrestling moments. And when you think about it, he's practically done everything in wrestling, so making him the cover star is a brilliant choice. Now, if you thought that announcement wasn't phenomenal, AJ Styles revealed himself that fans of this year's game will get a chance to compete in a competition for the amazing prize of $1 million. Yeah, that's right, $1 million, wow. During the conference, AJ revealed that players will compete in a new yet to be announced game mod for WWE 2K19 in which players will take part in qualifying matches in a bid to qualify for the million dollar challenge. Following the qualification process, players will then have to submit their very own promo stating why they should be the one to face AJ Styles, with the winner then going on to face AJ. I mean, that's like a brilliant prize in itself, should you lose? <laughs> Now, before anyone gets too confident or cocky, it was revealed by AJ himself that he is a massive gamer and he's not going to go down without a fight. So best of luck to whoever qualifies for that amazing opportunity. I mean, like, talk about, like, a massive opportunity for just your average fan. That's, like, amazing. <laughs> I do have to admit, though, a small part of me does worry when it comes to the connection and leg issues like we've seen in the past few games. And while it has improved over the last few years, 2K18 still did have its fair share of issues and one of the more important ones that I've witnessed, especially playing with the likes of Smack Talks and people is, sometimes we'd be competing and he'd be like giving it all mouth saying, oh I'm winning, I'm winning and then he'd cheer as if he'd won, yet my version of the game, I was winning and I was the one who managed to pick up the victory and that is going to be a main factor of the challenge and hopefully it does get ironed out by 2k. I, I don't know about you, but I just really, I can't wait to see how this game mode pans out and the competition itself because it's going to be something that brings the entire community together should they wish to partake and I just hope it's fun and not too serious, something everyone can get behind and we can root on this winner who's basically going to win a life-changing opportunity and they get to face AJ Styles, like, wow, that's like Wrestlemania. It was also revealed that this year's motto to the game is never say never. Now before we get too excited for what this might mean for the video game, it does make me think of all the dream female matches we've yet to see and it does kind of make me lean towards people like AJ Lee, which we probably know she's not going to be in the game but maybe we'll get people who featured in the Women's Royal Rumble, people like Kelly, Kelly, Lita, Trish Stratus, Lita and Trish are more of a given but someone like Kelly who hasn't been seen in a video game for years now, that'd be a great choice in I'd quite like to see Nia Jax throw Kelly Kelly around the ring one more time. So if we do take into account the female superstars that return to WWE in this year's Royal Rumble, it does leave us with Lita, Tori Wilson, Molly Holly, Michelle McCool, Vicky Guerrero, Kelly Kelly, Jacqueline, Beth Phoenix, Nikki Bella, Brie Bella and Trish Stratus. Of course, Trish, Brie, Nikki Lee and Beth and Jacqueline were already featured in the game, so it's hard to imagine that they'd take them out so soon. So does that mean we could see the likes of Tori Wilson, Molly Holly, Michelle McCool, Vicky Guerrero and Kelly Kelly returning to the series? Never say never. <laughs> It was also revealed that this year's edition of the series will hit shelves on October 9th on Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and for the first time ever, PC. The PC editions of the 2K series are usually released several months after the console editions released, making it a first time in the series. There was, however, a noticeable absence of that of the Nintendo Switch release date, which was panned by fans last year following a series of glitches, bugs, and the fact that the game was practically unplayable on the Nintendo Switch console. 
Of course, that doesn't mean there will be no Nintendo Switch version of the game to come out. It just means we don't have an announcement yet. Who knows, maybe the game could come out of several months later, like it has in the past, and with a PC version. Because, let's face it, while it might not have worked last year, we've had a whole year to work on things, and, and it would be great to have like a game on the go, because that's basically what Nintendo Switch is. It opens it to a whole new audience, and the fact that you can play with friends on the go, it's a great fun idea, and I know myself personally, I do love my Nintendo Switch. So there we have it, a pretty damn phenomenal 2K19 cover and a release date of October 9th and one hell of a brilliant competition. Let us know in the comments below what you make of the news and if you think AJ Styles is the right superstar to be featured on this year's game. I know I personally can't wait until October 9th and I just can't wait to see this year's creations because this past year the creators have bloody knocked the ball out of the parking. Some of the work's been phenomenal, some of it looks like it's been made by the 2K creators themselves and I just can't wait to see what they've put on show. So thanks for checking out the video, stay tuned to the revolution for more WWE 2K19 women's wrestling news, footage and breakdowns. Until next time.